everyone, this is Jamie Hera and today we are going to be making organic white bread. So now let's put on our chef costume. Now we need to know the ingredients. First, it's organic all-purpose flour. We also need caster sugar, milk powder, salt, yeast, and unsalted butter. You also need to prepare some tools. You need a loaf pan. You need a weighing scale. A dough cutter. Cooking roller. Mixer. And a bowl about this size. Now, let's start our baking adventure! Now, we will need to proceed to put the ingredients into the mixer. First, we need to put add in 250 grams of high protein flour. Now we need to add 30 grams of sugar. Next, we need to add in 5 grams of milk powder. Next, we will need 3 grams of salt. We will need also 3 grams of yeast. Before we proceed to pour this into the mixer, we need to have cold water. 165 grams of cold water. Now we're going to pour this into the mixer. Before pouring the cold water into the mixer, we need to close it and put it on slow speed. When everything is mixed in already, put it to speed for for 10 minutes. Let's check it. We still need 5 more minutes, speed 5. Wow! It looks very good! Next, we need to put unsalted butter into the mixer. Now, we will need to do speed 1. While it's on speed 1, I'm going to cut the dough into pieces and slowly add it into the mixer. Once everything is added and it's mixed well with the dough, I'm going to change it to speed 4. Let's do it! Once it's already mixed in, I'm going to turn it to speed for, for 10 minutes. Wow! It's looking very good. I'm going to go check the texture. Wow! Before we put the dough into the bowl, we need to spray it with pan oil. If you don't have this, you can use regular oil. This is for the dough to not stick to the bowl. We're gonna put the dough into the bowl. Now, we will need the cling wrap. We need to wrap it on the bowl. After that, we also need scissors to cut it off. Be careful. If children are doing this, you need to have your parents looking at you. Remember to secure it down. If you want to check the dough, whether it's double its size, you need to get a sharpie or any marker you like and trace around the dough. You need to use this stick to poke holes so that the air can come out. Now we need to cover it with a cloth. It needs to be at room temperature, which is 28 to 29 degrees for one hour. It's been one hour now, so let's check on the dough and see whether it's double its size. Whoa! It's now double its size. The circle and the dough has gone double its size. Look! Now we're gonna open the cling wrap. 
it's so big. Because we sprayed pan all, it's now not sticky so it's easy to come up. Now we need to put flour all over our hands so that it doesn't stick to the dough. Now we will take our dough cutter and cut it into three parts evenly. Now that it's separate into three parts, I'm going to take this dough and I'm going to make it so it has a smooth surface. Now we need to wrap the three parts over with the plastic bag. After we wrapped it with the plastic bag, we will need the cloth again and we will have to put it over the dough. Now we need to wait 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, you will need to take out the cover. Next, get ready for your dough roller. Put the dough over here and put flour on the dough roller so it won't stick. Roll it so the bubbles could come out but don't roll it too hard. After you finish rolling it, you need to grab it and flip it to the other side. Once you flip, you need to stretch it out. Why you need to stretch it out? Because if you don't stretch it out, Later, we'll need to do this and the dough will move forward. Let's get it. Once all the three parts are done, cover it with a plastic bag again and a cloth again for 15 more minutes. After 15 minutes, you need to do the same step again. Put it into the loaf pan. Now we will put the cover on 38 degrees Celsius for one hour. We also need to add in a bowl of water. We only need to add the bowl of water only because we don't want the dough to be dry. Before putting the bread in the oven, Preheat the oven to 200 Celsius for 10 minutes. When the bread is already in the oven, make it 40 minutes and 200 Celsius. Now the bread is done. We're gonna go check on the bread. But before that, we will need muttons because we don't want to get burned. Or if you're a child, you can ask help from your parents. Wow! The bread looks nice! It looks so yummy, I can't wait to try it! Now you need to set the bread on the cooling rack to let it cool. While waiting, you can play with your dogs, you can do anything, you can draw, you can do anything while waiting for it to cool down. Okay, bye! I'm gonna go play with my dog. See you later! Just kidding! I'm gonna give you three tips to help you make your white bread good. Tip 1. If you have a small oven, you need to cover it with a cover because you don't want the bread to be burnt. If you have a big oven like me, you can choose to have a cover or not. But I choose to put on the cover so it has a nice colour. Tip 2. You need cold water because you need to make the bread smooth. If you don't put cold water, it won't be so smooth when it comes out of the oven. Tip 3. When it's on the cooling rack and it's finally done cooling and it's already cold and not hot, you will need to proceed to put the bread into this box. If you don't put the bread into this box, it will harden. Now the bread is ready. Let's go check it. Now we need to use this knife to cut the bread. My mom is helping me and teaching me. 
It is so easy to cut through because it's not hardened because we put it into the box. Wow, it's so nice. Look how soft it is. I'm gonna try it. Mmm, this is very soft and nice. I recommend you to try this with strawberry jam because it's very good with strawberry jam. Thank you, mommy. My mommy just helped me to take this jam. She's such a good mom. Let's try it. Mmm. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe down below and remember to put the notifications bell on. Comment below if you want me to do something else like bake, any cake, any bread, anything you want for my next video. Bye bye everyone! This is cool.